Hey everyone, so Mosasaurus 6 here and today we are going to be reviewing tons of Jurassic World um, Fallen Kingdom stationary sets because obviously we're all going back to school now, September's here, so I thought why don't review loads of these little things that we can take back into the classroom. So I've got tons of things here and uh, we'll go through it one by one, so let's start off with, I'm just going to move it out of the way. We're going to start off with, I think, we can do my notebook. Now, I actually really like this notebook. I saw it and I had to get it. It is a holographic covered, uh, was it a lenticular covered notebook, I guess, if you want to call it that. I don't know if you can see it properly, but it's a really cool holographic cover, like a 3D version kind of thing with blue. So that's really cool. I've got the logo there. It's nice and blue obviously because of blue on the back we've got a really cool image of blue there as well um i just really like this so i thought why not pick it up and um the only it was the only one that they had um well jurassic world notebooks i didn't have anything else because obviously if they had the indoraptor or the t-rex i would have picked that one up easily but yeah open it up and um yeah just really lovely little notebook with a little jurassic logo there so I'll definitely be using that one. So that's really cool. And you've got this little elastic band over here so you can close it. So that's that one. Really cool though. Look at that. Love it. And next up, I thought we would buy this. Let me move this out of the way. Now, I saw this in Poundland, which is crazy because I never, hardly ever see um, Jurassic World stuff in Poundland. It's always full of Marvel, DC, and loads and loads of Star Wars, but I never uh, find Jurassic World stuff. I'm always trying to look for it, so I was really chuffed to actually find this. It's just really cool. So let's open that up. And it's been a long while since I had a Jurassic World or Jurassic Park pencil case. I used to have a Jurassic Park pencil case at school um, when the original movie came out, showing my age there. But anyway, this is really cool, pencil tin. And I think, so look at that blue again. So I like that we've got loads of um, version pictures of blue because if you look at the notebook, you've got that one and then you've got that one of her. And then this one, you've got like a really stylized version of her. And I like that Raptor. I wish it said blue on there, but whatever. It's cool. Um, yeah, we really like this. Nice tin case. And just... It's basic, but whatever. I really like the design on it. And I've seen this design quite a lot on t-shirts as well. That mouth is massively open. I don't know if Blue or these raptors do that, but I never um, saw the Jurassic Park uh, original raptors have mouths that wide, but whatever, that's really cool. So anyway, in that pencil tin, we can put loads of stationery that I picked up as well. Now, from this, this side here, so this one, um, it's got a little plastic pencil case with it, and it's got the little Jurassic Park, uh, Jurassic World logo on there, so that's pretty cool. Um, you can actually just have it like that, really. Also, I love these um, tags that they've got, and it's just got blue everywhere on them as well. Look, if you look at the other one, I've got two, got blue there too. But um, yeah, you can use this plastic little pencil case for stuff as well if you want to, but I'd rather put it in my pencil tin. So let's see what we've got inside here. Open it up and oh wow, I just noticed. Look at that blue uh, image there as well. This is really cool actually. And if you don't want to put your pencils in there, I'm sure you can use this. I can't even get this pencil out. Brr, this is so. There you go. Um, this is really cool. Now, if you don't want to use this as a pencil case, I'm sure you can use it for something else. Like, I don't know, when you go traveling, put your toothbrushes in there or. You can give it to your mum, she could put your eyelashes in there or your girlfriend or whatever. That's pretty cool, actually. You could make up brushes, paint brushes, whatever. So I can double that up with other things, actually, you know, which is really awesome. But anyway, a really cool image of blue there. Inside here, we get a pencil. This is all, like, blue-themed, I'm just noticing. Crazy. It's just all blue-themed. Blue pen with a blue nib on there. And then obviously, I don't know if it's got blue on there, does it? Oh my god, and it's actually got blue ink too. How cool is that? So that's all right. That's pretty cool. Blue. That can go in my pencil tin. We've got a pencil with um, blue on there again. Can you see? Yep, blue on there again. So yep, all good. I'll be sharpening that. 
We've got a rubber with no blue on there, weirdly, but we've got the cool Jurassic logo on there, which is awesome. And it's gray. I thought it would be blue. Huh. And then we've got a ruler with, again, blue on there. Now, obviously the blue image we've seen there, that's a cool one. And we've got another extra one there as well. Look at that, awesome. I love it. It's all blue themed. Wicked, so I can put that in there. I have another set of uh, stationery and it's got a lot of, oh wow, it's got another little plastic case on there. And I'll just open this up, if I can, yep. It's got another plastic case with um, blue emblazoned on it. And again, I've got another, if I can even get it out, here you go, another Jurassic <laughs> logoed rubber, so I've got two of those. Oh my god, they got like chips or something, poker chips. and stack them up. So I can put two in there. And with this one, we've got blue as a rubber. Which is weird, I didn't get any other one, but you got it in here. So that's really cool, I love that image. It's really nicely printed on. I don't actually want to use these though, that's the thing. You get all these cool uh, stationery and merchandise, you actually don't want to use them. So there's blue in there. And I'm going to put that in, and then you've got another blue, I've actually got three sets of, oh my god, I've got three, three blue rubbers. So look at that, I've got that, that, and I've got that. How cool is that? I wish I didn't open these, I'm going to put them back in. But look at that, they're really cool rubbers, and they're all on printed blue on them. Cool, cool, and cool. So I've got three of them. And again, that little plastic pencil case thing, so that's awesome. So right, I'm gonna put them in there. So I've got two of these that I can use for something, I'm sure. Um, oh, something just fell on the floor. On here, we've got um, pencil erasers and pencil toppers with blue on them as well. So let's open those up. Put them in. So, yeah, oh cool, this one's different to the other pencil, which, which had blue on it. This one's just got the Jurassic World um, logo, not like, um, sorry, title font. And then if you look closely here, they've got like things that say Raptor Trainers. So it's more Raptor orientated, this one. But, um, and you've got some Raptors on the sides uh, there as well. I don't know if you can see that. We got more raptors there. So more raptor themed, I guess. No T-Rexes, no Indominuses or anything like that. But hey, and you got a cool little pencil topper rubber on there as well, which is awesome with the Jurassic logo on there. It's a bit, little bit bendy, but whatever, it's cool. So I put that and that, and then the other pencil that I've got with it is the same, yeah, it's the same. Same pencil, but the rubber pencil topper on there, it's just got Raptor Trainer written on there. I like that design, it's pretty cool. So you've got two pencil toppers and, pencil, um, and pencils there, so I'll be putting that in my pencil case as well. And then finally, I picked up from Poundland again, is um, this Jurassic World coloring set, and again, blue emblazoned on there, and I think it says that you get Includes eight amazing color sheets as well. But I don't know, does that look like stickers as well? Oh yeah, it does, look, it contains eight coloring sheets, eight coloring pencils, and eight reusable stickers. Oh, completely forgot, this fell out. A sharpener with a design that I've never actually seen before to do with Jurassic World. Isn't even Jurassic World affiliate, I don't know. That just looks like a random dinosaur image. But hey, that could be it from anything, to be honest. So, not too happy with that one. Doesn't really look Jurassic Park um, official, but whatever. It's fine, I can put them in there. But anyway, let's open this colouring set up. And, oh cool, look at that. Please do not disturb, we've got a sign on there too. So let's open this up and then we're going to look at it properly. All by copyright design. I'm seeing that everywhere now. So there you go. Uh, let's open that up, and inside we get stickers, which are really cool. 
So I'm gonna be using, oh that's awesome, so you got two, a uh, couple of logos, this, yes this is a sticker, it's like, this is really cool because it looks like it's been, like graffiti spray painted, the, the, the design of it, so that's cool, we've got Rexy, which is really cool, blue, got Stegosaurus, Contained, Raptor Trainer logo again, another logo for blue, there's loads of different logos for blue isn't there, and then more Jurassic World, or the dinosaur logo is there. So that's cool. Um, oh wow, this is awesome. Jurassic World emblazoned coloring pencils. How awesome is that? They've thought of everything, haven't they? So, one, two, three, four, five, six different colors. That's pretty cool. I love this image of blue. I don't actually want to get rid of it. That's so good. I'm not going to throw that away. And then you've got coloring sheets in here. So we've got T-Rex. There you go. It's just like black and white coloring versions of like the CG mock-ups that you see on the promotional everywhere. So that's pretty cool. Got the T-Rex. We've got, I guess it's blue and no one else because blue is like the only Raptor left in the series. Unless we see Delta and Echo all that again, but I doubt it. We've got blue there. We've got a Gallimimus, which is cool. Can I zoom this out a little bit so you can see it properly? Whoops, I've just accidentally shut the lens. Can I zoom out? No, I can't. Okay, um, so yeah, I've got Gallimimus there. Looking a bit mean. There you go. We've got Triceratops and a baby trike as well. So that's cool. We've got Pteranodon, which is Awesome. I'm not really too fond of the way they've redesigned the Pteranodons for Jurassic World. I really like the ones from The Lost World and Jurassic Park 3, so I don't know why they had to do them again. There was nothing wrong with them before. I think the little horn bit on the head have, have um, has been like done smaller. So I'm not really sure about that. We've got another image of blue there in colour in. Really nicely painted and they've got like these slash marks as well going on the side in the grey paper. We've got a Triceratops, no not a Triceratops, we've got a Stegosaurus running. I've seen all of these promotional images before, they're just black and white versions of um, Triceratops. Yeah, I don't keep saying Triceratops, Stegosaurus running. And then a really cool image of the T-Rex, now look at that, that looks awesome, really cool. And you've got these little like scales and stuff on there too, which is brilliant. So there you go. This was only a pound, so I might actually pick another one up actually. But yeah, from Poundland. So if you're going past the Poundland, have a look, because the tin will be there and the colouring sheets will be too. So have a look to see if there's anything else in there. But yeah, that is the Jurassic World. Oh, and we forgot to show you. The do not disturb sign for your bedroom that you can cut out as well and put it on your door. So that's pretty cool too. Hey, awesome. So those are Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom, stationery and other bits and bobs that you can get on the cheap. Have a look in Poundland or, or anywhere else that you can find. But yeah, I really like these. I'll be having a look out for some more um, and see what we get. And I, I'm just got to say, I just really like these pencil cases because they're really just they're so versatile. I'm sure you can use it for loads of different things. But anyway, thank you for watching the video and we will see you again when I've got more stuff to buy. Have a good day. See ya.